I do not, do not want to um, tell you how long it took me to find the aluminium that I found last time. Again. Anyway. Uh, why do I always... I go into objects, then I just see blank. And I don't think... Other tab. And... Finally, Wilson. I'm back where I was before I got ice over and couldn't hold myself still long enough to breathe from a massive oxygen bag directly in front of me. I know I've got that thing clogging on my inventory now, but I kind of don't want to use it. I also kind of don't want to go anywhere near this blasted ice stuff ever again, but I'm going to go over here anyway. Why? I... I honestly don't know. It seems closer. And I don't want to go back over to the glass. I don't. I feel like I need to, but I don't want to. What's this? What is this? Depressurization may occur in the vicinity oh, of the toilet pump when the waste boy. tanks are damaged externally. It is highly recommended not to sit on it during such moments. He got sucked down a toilet. So, I feel like I know what I have to do for the glass uh, situation. If I go over... well... I got the underwear again. I didn't explore anything else of that area over there, which I could go and do. Um, because it did sound interesting. Well, sound. What am I saying? It looked interesting over there. I'm sure there's something to do. Now, it said if I urinate in space, the warm, warm urine will prevent me from freezing a bit faster. But, whoa, that doesn't work. Now, I assume I just passed through a super dense area of it. Maybe that's the point. Maybe there's a place you can go where it just doesn't happen so much. Now, if the I temperature understand control system right... proved to be extremely reliable and works even when the shuttle is destroyed completely. I wouldn't recommend disassembling and examining it. Oh, shoot. I completely forgot my auction again. No, please, I'm begging you. I don't care, I don't care, I don't care. I'm not having it happen again. Stop moving, you fool. I didn't expect the ice to come on so fast. What I think I need to do is basically Ugh I was pushing up against a freaking barrier. I didn't even know. What I think I need to do is try and aim for Now where's my ship gone? Just let me back in the ship. I think I need to do is go in with a very, very clear idea of where the next glowing orange thing is, and basically just aim for that. Um, and then hope for the best. I've wasted this thing. I put it way too close to the ship. But at least it's close to a de-icing thing? Sort of? A de-icing thing I couldn't get into because I couldn't see how to get into it. Pain in the rear. I want glass, though. Did I remember to remake the grabber? I think so, but I also want to see if this works as a grabber. Which it should. Get way too close to the glass. I'm going to need another one of these darn things. Let's go and scout it out. Was oh, that another coffin? I think so. Okay, up. And here. Sort of. This removes the ice? Maybe? Yeah. 
I'm sure I saw one in there. But is that one over there? Why am I doing this to myself again? It seems like it. The ice isn't creeping up too quickly. See, I see something glowing orange over there. Problem, I kind of just sit out by this thing. If I put another one over here somewhere... You know, I just feel like I'm not equipped for this. I want the upgraded helmet, but I just don't feel like I'm equipped for it. Maybe I'm... yeah, maybe I'm being stupid. Maybe I need to go somewhere else. Just somewhere completely else. Maybe there's some upgrade that will... help me with the ice. Because, like, I... the underpants seem to imply that it'll help me with the ice, but that doesn't seem to actually be the case. Way too close to the ship. This is exactly what's happening. When I can see it, I can correct for its weirdness. Okay. Jeez. Uh, let's get far away from that. What about down here? What's down here? This looks interesting. It also looks like it's not there. Anything but over there, please. I'm begging you. But this should be interesting. I can also figure out what that thing I found was. I. It looks like an underage child's cabin. I hope we won't find any dead children here, otherwise we will never escape the attacks of human rights activists. Why would I be... well... Oh... That's, um... Creepy. That's the word, creepy. What's this? Ooh! Oh no, that's what I was worried about. Uh... Corpse on horseback. I want to explore this thing more, but my air. If I made another one of those things, I could probably get it almost all the way down there. Oh, that's the... That's that other ship. I maybe just need to make tons of these things and put them everywhere. Yeah, I'll go back to the ship and I'll see if I can make more of these. Because I can't have this. I need to slow down on approach, despite the fact I want to get here so badly. Oh boy. The finer details of exploring this place are starting to get pretty... Uh, difficult. I don't think there's anything else to explore in that area specifically. I'd like to go back to the um, the mail thing and see if there's anything more there. Because uh, I just like looked at the first thing I found, got an achievement for it, and then flew off. So I'm sure there's more to find. Probably, maybe, maybe not. I have no idea. Bonk. Here we go. Hi, Wilson. I gotta say, just sitting in here, getting depressed and waiting to die sounds increasingly good every time I go out there. Alright, what's this thing? Shwarma. Until recently, she ran about and gnawed the wiring. Is that a burrito with a tail coming out of it? I don't want to know. Salty package. A package of an edible salt-based solution. Satisfies hunger well and pickles your internal organs. 
Okay, so the food gets more powerful, but with a th with a a um, water hit, which is interesting. I wonder if I ever get better water than this. Well, there's lots of ice around. Accelerator. A complex device for outputting accumulated gases to accelerate the body in weightlessness. Ineffective when used on a healthy stomach. Ah. So, we eat this thing. And then use our unhealthy stomach to help propel us through space. And apparently we swing it down with some yellowish water. Yay! You. Hey, anything that works in space when you're about to die, right? Just staying here and dying, that's, uh, that's definitely a worse solution than what I'm doing. Just keep telling myself that, Wilson. Keep telling myself that, and one day it'll be true. Hold on. I feel like I'm hungry enough that I should probably eat and drink some stuff. Um, salt. This, of course, is not ordinary salt, but a complex chemical product of the food industry. Yet it is no less salty because of that. If treating esophagus burns is undesirable, it's better to just hold before use. Noted. I should probably shove this stuff away from now until I need it. Just because it's taking up inventory space. I should also probably collect more ice when I'm just out and about. Because I need that for all of my nutritional things. It would be funny if making this thing uh, boosted my, my eat. Nope. Maybe if I equip it. No, apparently not. Oh well, never mind. Um, let's uh, drink some... Well, let's eat first. Then drink, drink, and... Yeah, fine. It's a little bit wasteful, but we can live with that. So... How do I boost? How do I use this thing? Alt? Left alt for stabilization? Left shift for acceleration? Is that... Oh, that's possibly what I want, is it? Fly bank? Okay. Um, anyway. So if I'm flying and I want to stop... Oh! Oh! That would have been so useful to know! And if I want to go faster... <laughs> That's ridiculous. Um... Whee! I wonder if we get upgrades to that. <laughs> oh, dare I wonder what they would be. Um, right, I want more of these. Auction candles and electrical tape. I can probably do that. Uh, I've got one more of these. I need more rubber for electrical tape. I know I saw a bunch of it over by the... over by the mach... Um, over here-ish, right? Let's get there faster! <laughs> Yay! Is that... is that more... Totally. Okay, hold on. I don't care. That's interesting. Um... No. And... Yes. Right. This drill hasn't got a whole lot of use left, does it? Okay, now I need these, Whoop. gimme, is there more? I could use some more. that I immediately see. I should go along there sometime and see if there's anything of interest. 
Wink. We stomach trouble has never been so useful. Who knew an unhealthy diet could be so so beneficial? Yeah, there was water just with lots of ice. You'd think I'd make this stuff naturally, wouldn't you? I wouldn't need to specifically make it. So every time I drink a bottle of water, replace it with, um, you know. Anyway. Oh, I forgot to grab my oxygen candle, didn't I? Yoink. I don't know if I like the fact that, like, uh, left click is to transfer things when you're in an inventory and to use things when you're not. It just feels like that can go so very wrong in so many different ways. Okay, let's go and explore the area with the children right after I sleep. Sorry, what I mean is increase my reserve oxygen supply. Okay. I'll be back, probably, Wilson. I assume. I assume I won't die in space. I was about to say again, but I didn't die. Right, Mr. Creepy Robot thing? How could I possibly die and also be telling my story? It looks like there is some more stuff in there. I should go along and see what's in there. But first, I want to go over here. I'll use the auction thing for over here. I feel there's probably not much in there. There might be something. But apparently, I just find upgrades by going to places. Go and approach anything interesting. Man, I hate that area. So much. What is that? I kind of almost don't want to use my booster on the way here, because that'll get the timing off, but I should be able to, like, factor in one full use of booster, right? This really isn't that far away. Too far to not have an oxygen thing. But, yeah. Okay, so I'll just float about here, and put you about here, and stop moving. Oh, that is going to be so useful. I need to, like, make a recharge for this thing and carry one with me always. Okay. Um. Uh, I suppose I might as well grab this, because it's just like, for the same amount of ice, I get more food. A little bit of dr a drink problem, it starts to put more emphasis on the ice, but there's lots of that around. What's this? What is this? Break. Eight, a box of salt. Sure! I'll just grab all of this. This is a haul. I could forget my food problems. I just do worry about the water ones. Okay. I hope I didn't put that thing there for no reason. Now let me get a better look, a better look at you. Hold on. The data analysis shows that this subject is 45 years old. This is an ordinary dead man with signs of drug intoxication. His body is reduced in half and he was killed in a sadistic way. It's alright, we've avoided a scandal. Okay. Sure. Uh-huh. There's metal around here. What's this? Milko, 100% synthetic. There was a time when the Cow Brotherhood successfully caused natural milk to be banned. Now everyone drinks this vile substitute instead, and the cows are slaughtered only from heat. What was the point of all this? It's anyone's guess. I'll take it, just in case that's an upgrade to my... <laughs> to my like made by an adult, or a hood. It's not possible to identify this precisely. I feel like I just missed something. Oh. I want to get a better look at that. Where's my oxygen thing? Oh. Now that I know how to stabilize myself, maybe going over to that other area won't be as bad. 
Hmm. A teddy bear with a mustache floating on balloons being attacked by bees with knives and guns. That's an interesting image. Is that water? Oh, alcohol. Um, movement can be so tricky. Where was that other thing? It was near a big hole in the in the it's like a big squarish hole. Oh, is that more aluminium? Because I can always use that. Always. Yep. I need a new drill soon. I should probably make a backup when I get a chance. This more salt. Oh look, my least favorite warning. We're not that far from the glass, huh? Now where's my oxygen thing on again? Okay, it's up here. Stabilize. Oh man, I love that button. That button is my new favorite thing in the world. Probably shouldn't linger around here if I don't feel there's anything to... Oh, here it is. So that's... Okay. What is this? Mr. Hypocrite. A poster with the famous superhero Mr. Hypocrite. Propaganda against sexism, racism, and other isms in all its glory. I don't know what to say. They didn't air this Marvel on TV when I was a kid. Kind of studio. Race neutral, den gender unidentified, half dressed. With support of the Anti Funds Foundation. For children aged over 25. I fear. Uh, what's this? Grumpy chicken. <laughs> A chicken from the rare series of collectible soft toys, Grumpies. These were sold at the five-year anniversary of the animated series of the same name by Unhappy Beasts. This grumpy beast brood will break your ribs, little dudes. I don't remember the rest of that jingle. I feel like I need to. I feel like I need to I'm take this. Scientists prove that an adult playing with toys increases not only the production of endorphins in the body, but also the conceit of others. Hmm. Well, there's a box. Oh, I could put stuff in the box. I'm not sure why I want to put stuff in a box over here. An ordinary rubber one. The funeral agency gives such balls to kids present at cosmic funerals. Oh, I don't know why, but I've always wanted one. Huh. Yeah. Why, because I have to take it then. I was going to leave it, but... That's the situation, you know. Can I examine this thing? No, but I can take this light bulb, right? No, okay. I feel like I'm not... I mean, the thing is, I just discovered more stuff here, so it's like... I could be missing even more, but... I feel like I've been floating out around here for long enough. I might just go and peek in here. We. That will never stop being weird, and possibly funny. See, this looks like something. I'm not sure what, but something. There should have been a joke about fat people here, but it didn't fit into the screen's text field. Oh. Did you really want it that bad? It looked terrible. And yeah, I got I got the I got the joke. I mean, would have put a joke about fat people here, but it didn't fit into the text field because the text was too fat. It's like okay. We 
Okay, so that's a little heartening. There's multiple places to get the stuff that you need for the upgrades. Uh, does, does, the, does the balloon get, get reduced? The balloon looks smaller than it was. Which would be an interesting detail. Oh, it is. It is shrinking. Well. You know, I could possibly go there now. I mean, not right this second. Well, maybe, maybe right this second. Hold on. I'm closer to it than I am to the... Than I would normally be, right? Oh, I shouldn't be using that. My thought is if I go over there and make use of the booster. This might actually be closer to it than the other one is. Make use of the booster to maybe try and get a little bit of time doing stuff here. Get a good little look. So I got the eye, which is maybe the only thing that I actually need to get from here, but... It looks like there's something over there. I didn't go over there. What's this? Just metal. Yeah, he had a bad day. Oh, scissors! Oh, I was, I was hoping I'd find some of them. I didn't mention it, but my, my cutters only have so much use, and I remember I needed scissors for them. Right, just look quickly, quickly, quickly. I don't have the air! What's around here? Anything? I don't see anything. What are these? Come on, quickly. Scan ret- oh, there's a, there's a scanner. Is there anything else? I don't think so. Okay. Where's my ship? I use the boost, I can maybe get back there in time. I'm well aware of that. Oh, I am well aware of that. I was, gonna th I was about to say that maybe I should try, what do they call it, feathering the thruster to get, try and get maximum use out of this. But it doesn't feel like that should work in this, given the context. Okay, that kind of worked. So I could kind of get back with about 30-ish air. Did I get anything new? Lots of this, lots of this, lots of this. Um, that thing, another one of those. This. I wonder if I can actually use that. I can bind it to the slot, so it kind of feels like you can. There's not like a use button on it though, so... Maybe not. Like, I can bind that to a slot. Right, uh, let's put away some of this, like, possibly next to all of that. Um, don't... the wire's gonna be used for, like, crafting things, as is that. I could use another drill. What do I use for the drill again? Tape and refined metal. Right, but for the tape I need more rubber which is a little bit of a precious resource. Oh, the ball. Yeah. Don't know why I wanted it, but I have it now. Plug. Oh, I need a helmet. I've got a full set of random useless stuff. Oh wait, what do I need to make the recharge for those things? Oops. It was, uh... Items? Yeah. Refined metal. I can make one of those. But then I'm starting to run low on metal again. I should just be, like, if I ever see it, I should just grab it. As a point of priority. There. 
I have that on me. If I ever need to recharge one of those things, I can. Good to have. Right, let's go down here. Oh, I passed by some ice. I should be grabbing more stuff. But I need to go and check out the retinal scan. Uh, which means I want this in my four slot. Should have done that before I left. Oh boy. I should not be... Oh. Okay. I'm actually just holding it like I want to place it. Which isn't what I want to do. I want to go over here and scan the retina. And see if there's anything good in here. The safe is private property, and the Global Funeral Agency is indifferent to the fact of its opening. The Breath Edge Global Funeral Agency. We care about your reputation. I didn't read all of that, or hear all of that, but I got the impression that you're judging me, machine. Oh yeah, there's lots of metal around here. Just grab some, while I push my luck and suffocate. Right, let's try not suffocating and instead going back to the ship. Just, just... Try, try not suffocating for a change. I feel like I should probably... Well, I feel like I could go back to the paint place and explore it a bit further now that I've got a little booster. But I don't currently see a reason to. I, if I ever need more paint, and I might need more paint, then I can go back there and explore it more thoroughly, but... Oh boy. I probably shouldn't be pushing things this close. Also because it means I feel compelled to rest. Which takes up precious time and food resources. Back up and going, right. So it seems I don't need to have this thing equipped, ever. Um, I just need to, um, what do I need for another one of those again? The electrical tape, which I found some of. I mean, that, that stuff is, that stuff's more precious than gold. <laughs> I wouldn't know what to do with gold in this game. Didn't I? Ah, battery and refined metal. I use my refined metal. I don't have any of my batteries on me. Right. One battery. And more metal, of course. Well, why don't I just go and beat some metal out of the air? Or, or, I can go and explore over here. If I travel through this thing, I feel like the chances of me finding little bits and pieces of metal to just pick up are probably pretty good, and I'll have explored more in the process. Win-win. What, what's that? You look... Oh, you look like something I could interact with, but you're not. We? Oh. The absence of movement of the nearby debris contradicts the basic laws of physics. Either someone forgot about the use of logic, or it is an anomaly formed in the radius of the destroyed core of the liner. Let's go with the latter, shall we? Metal plate. I mean, I assume I'll get metal. Oh, right. It is just the same thing. It looked different in the... The lighting. Still, I do need metal. So, yay. Okay, so that's the ship with the fat joke. So, I've now been through this area. Take that off the list of things to explore. I think I need to eat more burritos. Oh, I can go back over there now. Well, I could always go back over there, but. I can now go back over there with a booster which will allow me to explore a bit, a bit more. Is what I mean. I sure enough metal now to get another drill. Which is always handy. Because I'm going to need more everything. Okay, let me see. Let us make a refined metal. And then... I really, really wish that if I move off this tab, it wouldn't cancel what I was making. 
said it before, I'll say it again, I really do not like that. Okay. You know, I didn't I pick up another condom? Can I not, like, attach two of them to my suit? For double the effect? You'd think, it's just, it's, it's another balloon. Just going by the logic of the fact that it works in the first place. Was there something in the middle of this? Doesn't look like it. Is there anything here? Anything in these? I'll soon know. Oh, refined metal. Sure. I'll break open all these things then. Might take me a couple of trips. Wow, there's some great stuff over here. Oh yeah, I'm going to come back and get all this stuff. They're like better than the containers, but there are also some containers there. I find I have trouble swinging my handy scrapper sometimes, like I... I send a signal to my muscles to swing it and it just doesn't. And what did I find? A spacious travel suitcase every passenger used to have. The suitcase has no internal compartments, secure locks, wheels, retractable handles, or competitors. Okay. Use. What do I use it for? I install it. Here. No. Uh... Here. Oh. That's a pretty big container. And I can just carry that around with me? Huh. That could actually be kind of useful. Not right now, but... I feel like that would probably be pretty useful. If I ever want to take a lot of stuff from point A to point B. Now, what was I... what's this? Suitcase. Oh, I can now make them. Ah, and I can make one of these. I might hold off for now just because of how huge they are. Because I know where I want to go, and it's not somewhere where I need that. No, I am instead going right back over here. To break open more mail. Eventually, someone will find this wreckage and be like, right, Fantastic. We can get all of the mail that we lost um, when the ship crashed, because it should all still be nicely, safely contained in its boxes. And then they come over and find that all the boxes have been bashed open by someone, and they'll be looking at the only survivor. I knew I saw something floating here. Battery. Eh, I won't turn down a battery. What's this? Metal? I've got to, like, use the stabilizer more. Stop moving. Okay. Um... I should really have, like, had multiple of these in my slots. Okay, getting closer, and start smacking. Oh, darn. I'm already out of air. Well, not quite, but basically out of air. Got enough time to grab this, I think. Just metal, I could have gotten that out of anything. Whoops, I was flying in the wrong direction. Ah, uh, that would be bad for me. I could come up with some vague idea of what I would potentially need to try and eventually upgrade my oxygen. Hold on, I'm going to learn my lesson this time.
Because if I had some vague idea in my head, okay, if I had some vague idea in my head of um, where, well, uh, of what sort of things I could possibly do to get more oxygen capacity, then I could possibly, with that knowledge, oh, get some ideas in my head of where I'd want to look for the components for this idea that I came up with. I also need to see what that achievement was. I imagine it's going to be remarkably crude. Water. Eh, lots of water. A light bulb for some reason. Oh, scissors. Well, oh, alright. Wasted. Wait, I want to read this. No valuable goods are present anymore. Okay. Well, I can't pick that up. Well, I'll just have to... Is that another... Oh, that's another shawarma. I don't think I need another one of those. But I will try and remember... Oopsie daisy. I will... Tr I've messed up this time. I'll try and remember if I ever want another suitcase, or even more shawarma, that there's more down in the mailbox area. So the ship wasn't kidding, huh? All they, they literally went through, checked all the items for any valuables, was like, nope. No valuables anymore. It's an official... Official enough that they've got a sticker. A sticker that says... Waste. <laughs> it's like, you know... Uh, yeah, that's funny. There we go. Now, I don't need these on me. I don't, um... Need those on me, yet. That's still got durability of 10, that's not too bad. I'll keep one of those in there as a spare, and same for you. Um, I'll store some of this away, and then I'm out of space. Alright. I want to go and explore somewhere. I think. I think, against my better judgement, Against my better judgement, I think I want to go back to the icy area. Yeah. Well, want is a strong word. I think I should go back to the icy area. Oh boy, let's hope this doesn't end like last time. So how do I want to handle this? I think I want to get closer to the icy spot, but nearer heater, and then put down my oxygen thing, so I can sit there de-ice without having a significant oxygen problem. Maybe the one that's in there? That's pretty close. But maybe what I'll do is I'll go over there, and then I'll... Well, the problem is, I can't hover around and look at things. I can't really hover around and look at things. I didn't look at the achievement that I got. I wonder what it does. Assuming it actually gives me some sort of bonus. A lot of them don't seem to. And I'm actually, well, they all claim to do something. But the one that gives me plus charisma and a discount with elves, I'm guessing that's probably not going to be pertinent. But maybe I'm wrong and I'll find some nice elven folk to talk to. That'd be a thing. There's definitely a glow over there. If I could get to that glow and put down my oxygen thing. Tell you what, can I just, um... Yeah, th there we go. Um... Alright, if I can get to that orange and put down my oxygen thing, then maybe that's good. If all else fails, I can halt myself. A cemetery of rescue shuttles. The evacuation zone is very close, but the amount of debris is far from encouraging. Hmm. 
Yeah, I, I, I would agree. Okay. Okay. Let's get over here. Near this thing. Okay. Nice and stable. Come on. Just let me put it down. Let me put it down. Okay, I guess that'll have to do. So this is going better. This is going a lot better. I've got this. I've got this. This is my little safe zone. Just need to make sure I come back here before things get bad. Now, where's the glass? I've got my little grabbing thing here. Is this glass? Is that... Oh, is that glass? No. Are you glass? Or are you ice? You're ice. Um... Where's the glass? Well, it's, it's probably just a targeter, isn't it? It's probably, like, actually in the machinery here. Or down there? Jeez. If these are meant to be the rescuers, then I really don't like my chances. I can get over here near the warm, near the warmth. Recharge my oxygen. Another coffin over there. Bonk. Okay. I heard you the first time. And the second, and the third, and in fact every time you brought it up. It is highly recommended that you not touch the glass fragments with your hands. Tiny splinters are able to pierce the thin fabric of the spacesuit and cause a slight death attack. Well, I'm looking for the glass. I really am. Nice heater in here. Is this glass? It looks kind of jagged. Yes. This thing doesn't count as a grabber. It's got like a durability and everything. A dangerous object. Okay. This isn't actually going too badly, actually. <laughs> Especially considering the complete panic storm that happened last time. This is not going too bad. Let's just uh, have a quick... Stop! 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 Oh god, stop! Why do those two buttons need to be next to each other? Okay. Alright, since I'm here... Is this glass? Or ice? Glass. No, that is a ball of ice, not glass. It's concerning these two things are together. It gives you the feel... I mean, if this was water pouring out in a place where glass was was flooding around, you kind of think the two things are going to have bumped into each other and uh, the water will be... The water, the ice, will be full of little glass shards and that'll be very bad for me. I don't know if I need this much glass. Probably not, especially as I'm running out of space. Come here. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Much, this is a much smarter way of dealing with the problem than whatever I was doing before. Oh, there's something through there. But that looks like a horrible place to go. So the ice does seem to eventually wear off if you get far enough away from the cold. Or find a nice, convenient heater. But, um... Alright, I don't think there's anything else here. Uh, oh, I haven't been, like, right down to the floorish level. Like, this looks like it was a hangar or something. Was there a hangar of rescue ships, like, in case of emergencies, and they all got destroyed? 
because that would kind of make sense. I guess? Except not. Okay. That's enough. I'm just going to go up here, de-ice, breathe, and then fly on back to the ship and hopefully upgrade my blasted helmet. That'd be a good thing to do. Ah. Okay, let's fly home via my other thingy. This wasn't so bad. And this might be a waypoint to going wherever that other thing is going. So long as I can hit the... As long as I can hit the, um, the, the, the warmth points, then the ice shouldn't be a problem. I could also skirt around the ice problem that way. This does seem more direct, though. You know, I'm going to fly down here. Just because I want to get a better look at, like, my options for, few, for further. Because I actually, I've kind of explored everything around here that I can see. So, okay, you've got this. There's a big jet of water coming from that way. But yeah, it looks like the next thing to explore is over there, and I can cut through the ice zone. And I've already got some breathing apparatus over there. It also looks like that goes a bit deeper. Do I want to make a kit and go over there? Oh boy. This thing doesn't have a full tank of air in it, does it? What happens is it, when it runs out? Does it destroy, or do I have time to recharge it? That one's basically dead. If I ever come back to that one, I need to make sure I've got a recharging thing for it. Which I do have. And it should be fine, but I uh, just need to bear that in mind. I'll forget, but well, I should always have one with me. I intend to always have one with me. Good look at my helmet. Oh, I can make it all ready. Due to the high toxicity level of the renewed painting of the spacesuit, the probability of your death from radiation is now lower than the probability of death from the suit itself. In this regard, you can fly to the evacuation point. <laughs> okay, the the suit itself is now more dangerous to me than the radiation, meaning that the radiation danger no longer seems so bad. Yay? Question mark. Wow, I've got a lot of glass. Hmm. Armored glass for windows with increased protection against radiation is transparent, hard, and sharp at the edges. Attempts by persons to break it using their heads haven't been successful yet. Oh dear. Uh, I'll just drink some water. I feel like I need to... My health seems kind of low. I mean, I know I take stupid damage all the time. But, um... Still seems kind of low. I want to know, can I still pick this up now? You can't, uh, you can't take a container with items in it. What's the point of the suitcase then? Right. Ugh. Okay, so the suitcase is extra storage while I'm here, but I can't use it to carry stuff around. That, uh, why even have it? Okay. Right. Um. Whoops. Hmm. Uh. I wanted to check if there's anything else I can make. Because at the moment it doesn't seem like it. I can make these. And I might make one. Just to have it on me. Because then I've got food and drink. I'm also carrying some glass around for some reason. I feel like I've missed a joke or two along the way. It's highly recommended that you do not touch the glass from so your hands tiny splinters are able to pierce the thin fabric of your spacesuit and cause a slight death attack. 
It's much safer to pick up the pieces with some kind of tool and put them, and put them in your pocket. The pocket's made out of the same fabric of the spacesuit. So tree of refuse on the refuse zone is very close, but this amount of debris is far from encouraging. You're not wrong. Uh, oh yeah, this safe is private property, and the global funerary agency is indifferent to the fact of its opening. Yeah, okay. Oh, and I got a uh, thingy, didn't I? What is this? The artist can offend and draw anyone. Usually this happens simultaneously. You can recreate the images drawn on the dummies with a marker on the wall of your living room? Your mum won't even know. You can solve any case if you know for sure who you want to blame. That feels like it's going to have something to do with the thing down there, right? And then this might be to do with a painting on that other thing? I feel like maybe I've missed something. It's indecent to fart on Earth, but farting in space can save your life by giving your body acceleration at the last moment. The gas on the accelerator is consumed more slowly. Apparently the intestines stretch out. Oh dear. Your the suit will consider you to be very smart. Just kidding, you won't. Create the images. Oh, right, so these don't actually bring me any benefits, I guess, but... Uh, I'm trying to understand this. Really trying to understand this. Sorry, I'm... I'm I'm looking at it and I'm half reading it and I'm also half trying to not read it because um, that just, yeah. I, I kind of want to read them, but I also kind of don't want to read them. I'm so torn. But I also feel like I've come to the end of my time. I know this episode ended with a bit of a whimper, which is a shame. Uh, and I'm sorry about that. But, uh, hey, the next one should be kind of exciting. I'm going off to see what's beyond the ice area I, I suppose can't think where else to go but to try and get to the evacuation point which makes sense I guess I, I want to I want to evacuate I definitely do anyway this was Silvertail we should have come back if you like we see we would always pack a plan D because here they're well there aren't dragons sadly no dragons in space but uh, see you next time